Hi everyone, or at least everyone that watches this. Uh, I'm getting ready for Blood Rage and I'm actually doing something with uh, the Battle of Five Armies. Something I promised somebody back in July uh, that I would do. Uh, but I also promised them I'd get to it when I can because my charity projects were a lot more important at the time. Um, I'm also working on this horse heresy because I at least want to get it completely together. But the real reason I'm here is I guess it's it's unusual that I would do two videos where I would just talk right in a row or one right after the other. But I was I was just looking around and I was trying to get some rules for um, Warhammer Quest, uh, the board game, um, and I wanted to. I wanted to learn it because I wanted to film it with the kids and 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 give you guys a little more content this week along with the Blood Rage and the Rum and Bones and stuff that I plan on uh, tomorrow and the rest of the week. And I ran into this video. Now, let me tell you a little bit about me. I'm a pretty old guy, but I bench press over 550 pounds. I squat in insurmountable numbers and I've I'm a big strong guy and and um, you know this uh, this April I think I'm going to take a shot at at the senior division of trying to win the powerlifting championship of Florida I know I can do it um, I'm in tremendous shape but for all my strength I do not have the strength of this one woman that I saw on YouTube today and maybe I'm a little oblivious because I really don't go looking for a lot of things or or watching a lot of inspirational stories um, I'll check out a lot of things from the Make-A-Wish Foundation and, and I can never do what some of those athletes do um, you know that 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 these people idolize and they just go and see. But I seen this woman and her name is Lizzie Vasquez. I hope I don't chop it to pieces. And she was called the world's most ugliest woman, and I found that absolutely horrific. And that title just stood out on YouTube, and I had to click it and find out. I mean, why would anybody ever do something like this? Why would anybody ever hurt somebody that way? Yeah, and and it just sickened my stomach. But it was actually an inspirational story. It started off pretty bad because somebody had put on the internet. This little girl was born sick. Um, she can't gain any weight, and uh, she's blind in one eye. And um, and it it just moved me in such a way just to see how strong she was and how hurt she was by by people i just don't understand that and you know i i try not to make this channel about preaching to people and and stuff like that i i, I just think there's good in everyone and sometimes people lash out at other people because they just hurt inside themselves and sometimes if you can heal them they'll they'll understand what they did wrong. Of course, I try to wear rose-colored glasses at times, but that's me. But to see this woman just turn this absolutely horrific thing where people said that she should have been aborted and, and destroyed and and burnt and, and just put a gun in her mouth, it it moved me in such a way and then I saw how she took that and I guess she's been on the TV circuit and things like that and, and everything and I was just blown away that somebody would be that brave and have that kind of strength and it just made me feel how insignificant this little channel is that she's able to reach so many and I wish I could do I wish I was as brave as her I wish I was as strong as her you know, when somebody says something bad on this channel, it, it hurts me deeply. And yet, millions of people said things to her that were just horrific. 
horrific. And now uh, that's totally changed now, thank God. But um, I think the thing that really got to me was just how strong she was. And you just look at her. She's just this little 24-year-old girl. She couldn't weigh more than 70 pounds. I'd curl her with one arm. And yet she has more strength than I'll ever have my entire life. She'll, she's braver than I've ever been. And I've been places around this world and done things that I thought were bravery. But I couldn't match her bravery. So I wanted to make this video to say I'm with Lizzie too. And if you go to I'mWithLizzie.com, drop her a note. Subscribe to her channel. Support her. She has a channel also on YouTube. She has her own website. And she's living a wonderful life and spreading her message of inspiration and motivation. And listen to her story. Because anything I can tell you here isn't half of what that girl can tell you and inspire you to do. So I ask all of you to discover this girl. Open up your hearts and watch these videos that she's made. Watch her channel. We'll go to her website and see the, what true beauty is. I'm not even worthy to carry this girl's shoes. But I hope someday to be. If I can strive to be as great as she has become. And I ask all of you to go out there and support this website. So, uh, I think that's all I had to say. Um, at the end of this, I guess uh, maybe I'll just tell you what's going on with the channel. We're going to be painting all our charity stuff. You'll see some films up tomorrow. You'll also see the Blood Rage stuff. Um, no, oh, rum and Bone stuff that will be painted. And it's New Game Day tomorrow. So, you'll have to deal with another rant from me. Three in a row. I guess it gets a little noxious after a while. So please, check out those websites. Um, I'll post something right here. And um, just go check it out. Thanks. Have a wonderful night. Thanks for listening to me rant. Have a great day.